yes i am back and i'm in the same top i was in my last video welcome back to my channel now in today's video i'm going to be doing a everyday makeup routine because everyone always asks me like what makeup do i use like what do i do with my normal makeup routine on a daily um so i might as well just sit here and show you it's that time of year where everyone is sniffling cold to go in about like it's not fun got my toilet roll here but I thought I would take you along on my little everyday makeup routine. Oh my god, did you hear that? That was my stomach. Holy moly. My stomach is moving mad. Um, so the, basically the first thing I do to kind of get my skin going is the CeraVe. I'm actually running out of this. It's very empty. Um, I just... Put a little bit, just put a little bit all over my face and rub it in. Now I do actually have lash extensions on, so normally I would put lashes on and do my lashes. But best thing ever having lashes done because it makes your makeup routine so much more quicker. So there we go, I put my moisturiser on and wait for that to set in, settle in, soak in. Seriously, very good. Okay, so the next thing I do is put some lip balm on, if I can open it because my hands are that slippy. And it's the Cocoa Butter Formula, the Palmer's one. Can't go wrong with a Cocoa Butter. So just put that. Honestly, I could eat this. It smells really good and tastes really good. Sorry, my makeup drawer is here and honestly, it's a mess. I always organise it, but whenever I do my makeup, I literally just throw everything back in the drawer. Um, um, anyway, so the concealers and foundations I use is Kat Von D Foundation. The Rimmel London Lasting Finish Foundation and the Nip and Fab Concealer. This foundation smells amazing and look at the applicator. Look at that. It's honestly such an easy applicator um, for it. So basically what I do is, this is full coverage and this is not really full coverage so Depending on how I'm feeling, if I'm going out clubbing, I will put the Kat Von D on. Or if I'm going, basically, if I'm going out, I will put on a Kat Von D foundation with this and I'll mix it in to make it more full coverage. But on a day-to-day -day basis, I normally just wear this one. But I'm feeling a bit out there today, so I'm going to put some Kat Von D. This one's very light for me. And then normally I just put some of the rimmel on the side of my hand. Can you see? Then what I'll do is I'll just get my brush. And just put it all over my face. Now, I wouldn't really say I am the makeup guru, so I just know how to kind of do my own makeup. I wish I was good. <coughs> actually just stuck the whole brush up my nose and made my nose tickle. Okay, so I've basically done from here down. But yeah, that foundation is very full coverage. You can kind of see. That's all done and that's not. Um, so basically I'm going to do the same again. Put a bit of my rimmel on my hand. 
I'm actually running out of this Rimmel, but that Rimmel's also got SPF in it, which is really good. Okay, and then a little bit of the Kat Von D. Mix it in and plop it on the forehead. Now, it is a bit light for me, but... What can I do about it? Nothing. I haven't had a car for, like, two weeks because it's been in for a service. So that's fun. Basically been locked away. If I got locked away. But, yeah, that's what I do. I literally just pay it. I'm probably not even, honestly, like, please don't take any tips from me about doing makeup because I literally just slap it on my face. Best way to be. <laughs> um, but as you can see now, she's covered, and I do have a big foundation on my hand. Okay, base is done. Now I'm using a bit of concealer. I'm using the Nip and Fab concealer. I got actually, I actually got this from TK Maxx. It is a bit dark for a concealer but I really do like how it kind of does my under eyes now I know you're meant to bake but I actually don't have baking powder I never really have because I've never really known which one is best for you like what one to buy but I would like to start doing it because I actually got my makeup done by someone who's really good at makeup and like qualified in doing makeup and she baked me <laughs> and I loved the finishing like matte to it instead of you just be shiny like yeah it's good to be shiny but it's not good to be oily shiny that's what the bacon kind of does I think it gets rid of can you see what we're kind of going for so I've just basically put on my concealer, um, and that is all I use for that. Next we have powder. Now I actually use the Mineral Magic um, powder. It looks like this. It's got like colourful spots in it, but it like mixes and blends into your own tone of your skin. It's really confusing. I don't really know how it works, but I've been using it for years, and I swear I buy it. So does my sister. My dad actually bought it for us one year, um, and ever since then, we love it. So I basically just put this around my face, all around, all around, and just like that. Also, these are the lashes I normally do use, they're from Amazon. I'll try and find the link and I'll link them below, because I always get asked what lashes I use, but obviously I've got... <clears throat> am I okay? I have my lash extensions done. They are kind of like three weeks. This is like the fourth week. They are holding up strong. Um, but I'm getting them done before my holiday at the end of this month. So I'm just fingers crossed they'll last a bit longer. Um, actually, stop crying. Um, okay, what do I do next? Okay, so the next thing I do is I use this Four Scope Benefit Bronze Blush and Highlight Palette from Benefit. Love Benefit. One of my favourite makeup brands. And look at this palette. That is all you need in a palette. It's got your bronzer, your highlight and your blush. And they're all beautiful colours. <clears throat> I'm obsessed. Okay, where's my brush? There she is. Okay, so for bronzer, I literally... That's it, all I do. Can you kind of tell? And then I kind of do like the three know what Kim Kardashian does I think that's who everyone like went off what she did she did like a makeup routine once basically trying to make myself look less pasty white and more more bronze Okay, so that is literally all I do for bronzer. And then for blush, I literally just dab the same brush in. And put a bit of blush on my cheeks. I don't do highlight yet, I need to do my brows. For my brows now, Benefit actually sent me this PR package. And literally, look at it. It's all full of brow stuff. I'm sorted for my brows for days. Um, but, where is it? 
this is what i use it's the brow conditioning primer and it's just like a brush i can get it out you literally just turn the bottom use my little or not use my little brow mirror um i'm not very good at doing my brows my brows actually doing but I basically just brush my brows through with it. I'm gonna do soap brows. But today I'm not feeling the soap brows, I'm just feeling brushing them through. And that is literally all I do with my brows. I'm so sorry that's so boring. I'm so sorry about that. This video is probably so boring, you're probably like, Anna, what are you actually doing? I don't know. I really don't know. Uh, I got sent all this brow stuff and I just don't know how to do my brows. I'm scared to do my brows because I feel like brows can really change you as a person. I don't know, that's just how I feel. So then basically I do some highlight now. Literally just dab. Like, look at that highlight. Dab it on my nose, on my lips. gonna get a teeny tiny little woohoo and do it in the corner of my eyes to make me you know look some sort of awake and a bit on my eyebrow like that let me pull these brushes away so i actually have tied in my room to finish off with i use the lifter gloss by maybelline honestly it's like the fenty beauty one but half the price Put the gloss on. And that is literally it. Okay, and that is basically all I do for my makeup. This is literally an everyday makeup for me. So I'm really sorry if this is boring. But I just thought I'd show you because I get a lot of questions asking what I do for my makeup. So I just thought I'd quickly film this video for you guys. And yeah, hope you enjoyed. Please like and subscribe to this channel. Like I said, if you want to see more videos from me. But I love you all so much. And thank you for watching this video.